2026 Ram 1500 Ram Charger is a range extender electric truck blending battery power with a 3.6 liter V6 generator to deliver a class leading 690 mile range. Unlike full EVs, it avoids frequent charging stops by using its gas engine as a battery charger, extending range when needed. It starts with 145 miles of pure electric driving from a 92 kilowatt hour battery before the generator kicks in, ensuring long distance capability without reliance on public chargers. The Ram Charger's dual motor all wheel drive system cranks out 663 horsepower and 615 pound feet of torque, launching this massive truck from zero to 60 miles per hour in just 4.4 seconds. It's built for tough jobs with a 14,000 pound towing capacity and a 2,625 pound payload, surpassing rivals like the Chevy Silverado EV. It supports 400 volt DC fast charging at 145 kilowatts, adding 50 miles in 10 minutes. Plus, with bi-directional charging, it can power homes, tools, or even other EVs, making it more than just a truck. Why did Ram prioritize this over a full EV? Simple, EV truck adoption is slow and many buyers still worry about range, especially when towing. Stellantis pushed back the fully electric Ram 1500 rev to 2026, focusing first on the Ram Charger, which appeals to truck owners hesitant to go all electric. Some call it a hybrid, but it's different. Unlike plug-in hybrids, the Ram Charger's gas engine never directly drives the wheels, it just keeps the battery charged. Stellantis calls it an A-Rev, uh, extended range electric vehicle, though debate continues over whether it should be considered an EV due to its tailpipe emissions. Experts predict a starting price of $70,000 to $80,000, reflecting its dual powertrain, high towing capacity, and advanced tech. It'll likely sit between gas-powered Ram 1500s and full EV trucks like the F-150 Lightning. The Ram Charger offers a smart alternative for drivers who want EV benefits without range anxiety. With 690 miles of total range, fast charging, and heavy-duty performance, it's a compelling option for those who aren't ready to go fully electric, but still want to embrace the future, launching in late 2025.